going to change the world is robotics. Robots are going to handle the difficult tasks and make our life easy. We have already started using robots in industries for manufacturing, robots in home for cleaning purpose, personal robots, social robots, self-driving cars, service robots, entertainment robots and many more. Learning robotics will be an essential skill in the future and a lot of companies have already started the research in robotics. A lot of startups are also coming in robotics with the innovative products and they are successfully funded by crowdfunding campaigns in Kickstarter and Indiegogo. So why are you waiting? Let's learn robotics together. The book Learning Robotics Using Python will be a quick start guide for learning robotics and start building robots. The book teaches you to build an autonomous mobile robot using robot operating system, computer vision library and programming team using Python. There are 12 chapters in this book and following are the topics covered by each chapter. The first chapter is Introduction to Robotics. This chapter is mainly intended for beginners. It is mainly discussing brief history of robotics and robots and giving proper definitions to it. The second chapter is Mechanical Design of a Service Robot. It covers the mechanical design of a service robot called Chefboard, which can able to supply food in hotels and restaurants. In this chapter, we can see both 2D and 3D CAD design of this robot using open source tools called LibreCAD and Blender. The 3D modeling is done using Python scripting in Blender. The third chapter is working with robot simulation using Rose and Gazebo. This chapter covers the simulation of robot using Gazebo and performs SLAM and AMCL in a hotel-like environment using Rose and Python. The fourth chapter is designing chefboard hardware. In this chapter, we are covering the component required to build the robot and the design of robotic hardware. The fifth chapter is working with robotic actuators and wheel encoders. This chapter covers interfacing of wheel encoders and actuators to robot controller board called Tivasi Launchpad. The sixth chapter is working with robotic sensors. This chapter covers interfacing of robotic sensors such as ultrasound sensors, IR distance sensor, MPU6050, IMU to the Tivasi launchpad. These sensor data are required by Chefboard for its proper operations. The seventh chapter is programming vision sensors using Python and ROS. This chapter covers the interfacing of 3D visual sensors such as Kinect and ASUS Extension Pro in ROS. In this robot, we are using Kinect instead of laser scanner. Here, we are converting point cloud data from Kinect to laser scanner equivalent. Thus, we can avoid the expensive laser scanner and reduce the cost of entire robot. The eighth chapter is working with speech recognition and synthesis using Python and ROS. This chapter is covered how to implement speech recognition and synthesis in Chefboard using Python and ROS. The ninth chapter is applying artificial intelligence to Chefboard using Python. This chapter teaches you to apply artificial intelligence technique to build an intelligence to Chefboard for interacting with human beings. We are using AI pattern matching techniques to implement intelligent behavior in robots. The 10th chapter is integration of Shepard hardware and interfacing it into ROS using Python. It covers the complete integration of software and hardware system of Shepard. We are implementing autonomous navigation using SLAM and AMC in hardware. 
The 11th chapter is designing a GUI for a robot using Qt and Python. This chapter covers building of a GUI controller for Shepard which is mainly intending for non-technical users. The GUI is based on Qt framework and coding using Python. The 12th chapter is a calibration and testing of Shepard. It covers the calibration, testing of each sensor on Shepard and at last we can see the robot deployment. Thank you for watching and start learning robotics today itself.